I am George Mihalopoulos, General Manager for Alpha Bank's Wealth Management and Treasury Functions. We are here to delve into our plans for the coming years, highlighting the main elements of our strategy that will enable us to deliver double-digit annual growth rates for asset balances and profitability. We have a long-standing and strong foothold on both wealth management and treasury, two units sharing the financial markets backbone with synergies between them. The wealth management side manages 11 billion euro of customer assets, representing a sizable fee revenue pool for the group. It supports all customer segments with investment products and services, and includes the private banking arm serving its customers directly. The Treasury area, managing for most a securities portfolio of 13 billion euro, is a notable contributor to the bank's profitability. It operates within the context of the wider market strategies endorsed at the asset and liability management level. We will zoom particularly into the wealth stream, which complements and enriches our commercial banking services portfolio in Greece. This is a capital light business that provides strong linkages to our retail and corporate franchises enhancing customer loyalty, service and profitability, and fits well with our focus on relationships and high-value-added services. Let us first take stock of the current state of the Greek asset management sector. Greek assets under management, or AUMs in short, have grown at an annual pace of 10% in the last three years, significantly outperforming the European average growth rate over the same period. Still, the Greek market remains massively underpenetrated, with AUMs as a share of total financial wealth at just 11% in 2021. Regional peers enjoy much higher levels, with the market in Portugal at twice this level, Spain at three times, and the European Union average at four times this level. Evidently, great potential lies ahead. Additionally, some noteworthy macroeconomic developments underpin growth dynamics of this market. First, households' disposable income grows steadily, and we expect this to continue at an annual rate of 4%, increasing the demand for financial and wealth services. Second, the welfare reform impetus is on its way, mobilizing a significant institutional bid for financial wealth services and deepening the capital markets function, mainly through the long missing link of occupational funds. Third, Greece is at the cusp of gaining the investment grade status, thereby amplifying confidence, eating into the risk premium of our operations and handing us the passport to draw upon Greek wealth sitting outside the borders and estimated to be over 40 billion euros. Concurrently, there are a few noticeable cultural and structural trends. Democratization of wealth services allows us to gradually downstream our wealth offering to underpenetrated client segments posting lucrative fee collections. Financial literacy is improving, with all generations becoming more astute to holding the right financial services basket for their profile. Digitization augments our capacity to expand our business into low-touch and self-service clients and to enhance the servicing of our upper segments by releasing and empowering human resources even further. And last but not least, the product proliferation push, enabling us to populate our portfolio offering with more sophisticated, more tailored and modern products, such as ESG, thematic and profound investment structures. We expect the aggregate effect of these tailwinds to yield an AUM growth rate above 15% for the next three years with AUM penetration rate doubling to just shy of 20% of deposits. Alpha Bank is today on pole position and is best equipped to capitalize on this fast-evolving, transformative and attractive environment. Over the last 30 years, we have crafted a robust wealth management DNA comprising of a top-quality investment proposition partnering with reputable investment houses globally, a competitive product palette coupled with a talented relationship manager's force and a focused service model on advisory and discretionary mandates. Altogether, aligned to appeal to over 200,000 clients belonging to our affluent and high net worth segments. The strength of our franchise is evidenced by our accolades. Clients grant Alpha Bank an impeccable net promoter score, reaching 51 in 2022, more than double that of 2019 and significantly above the European average. International institutions and analysts repeatedly rank Alpha Bank first bank in Greece for its private banking franchise. And commanding a 30% market share in mutual funds distribution in Greece, Alpha Bank is the market leader. My team's mission has been to provide quality investment advice to clients by being in constant contact with our clients, dynamically informing them of market conditions, providing them guidance on how to position their portfolios and execute their strategy. We have become their trusted advisor. Finally, having the privilege to meet clients in person, participating in more than 1,000 meetings per year, 
we ultimately gain direct insight into clients' needs, concerns, goals, which we then subsequently feed back internally to be taken into account when devising financial solutions, by which we in essence remain true to having our clients at the corner store of our business. Indeed, over the last three years we have delivered a noteworthy financial performance. Our AUM portfolio has reached 11 billion euro at the end of 2022, growing at an annual pace of 10% since 2019. And we have improved the productivity of our book, increasing return on assets by 13 basis points in the same period. As a result, our revenues in 2022 amounted to 86 million euro, exhibiting a 16% annual growth rate since 2019. Looking ahead, we will continue to leverage our leading position while further enhancing our model. Our first objective deals with our wealth engine. We will scale up and refine the core capabilities embedded in our distribution model with an aim to capture the entire spectrum of the addressable wealth customer base, straddling from the more sophisticated clusters over and above private banking to the emerging affluent segments at the other end. Hence, our engine-related initiatives entail reinforcing our advisory services to deliver inter alia a consolidated portfolio construction, market positioning, investment profiling, upgrading our product suite to accommodate new trends and non-commoditized products, expanding our commercial playbook and extending training to cover the front end of our sales force, introducing a new referral scheme to foster cross-selling and capture synergies, especially with wholesale. And last but not least, paving the way to approach offshore wealth that could drive business into a new era. The key here is productivity in the form of AUMs per relationship manager, which we set at a level of 25% higher than current. Our second objective deals with a segment-specific investment proposition. Our initiatives will clearly cater for the right profile and structures pertaining to the client characteristics. Namely, for our private banking clients, it means deepening our offer with sophisticated, bespoke and total wealth solutions. For our affluent and core clients, it incorporates light discretionary management services with product bundling characteristics and step-by-step -step investment patterns designed for first-time investors and aligning our firepower with retail. And for our international clients, it involves the gradual rollout of wealth management services to them, combining local distribution with our central powerhouse. The bar here points at a 20 percentage point increase in the penetration of investment products within the client wallet. And lastly, our third objective deals with technology. We will digitize and realign our service delivery, promoting the optimal route for its customer journey at a different degree of digital to human interaction, depending on segment and product mix. Our focus will be on a unified digital platform, connecting the investment and advisory hub to all channels for all segments. This is the internal part. An end-to-end -end digital customer journey where appropriate. This is the external part. And an individualized service model to strike the right balance between customer idiosyncrasies and value added. This is the wrapper. Our thrust is to have 30% of our clientele interacting with us digitally. Putting it all together, we are confident our actions will strengthen our competence, extend our reach and steer performance. This way, we will solidify our leadership position in the wealth business in Greece while serving our vision to create, enhance and sustain wealth for our clients. When it comes to financials, we subscribe to the following overarching targets. A 13% annual growth in AUM balances with a target of reaching nearly 16 billion euro of AUMs at the end of 2025 and a commensurate annual growth in revenues to reach 126 million euro by the same year. Effectively, our strategy will deliver sustainable results, accreting a 6% points increase in return on capital for the segment of wealth management and treasury.